What is going on everyone? My name is one of you don't care my name is and today I'm going to be reacting to a new death battle fight between Tanjiro from Demon Slayer versus Jonathan Joestar from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Alright, so Demon Slayer, I haven't watched that in quite some time. Same thing with JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. So I'm going into this thing, not really sure who's going to win this fight, but it could go either way, especially when it comes to death battle. So let's check this fight out. I don't know anything from this. It's owned by Death Battle, which is owned by Rooster Teeth. So let's check this fight out between these two anime shows and see who's going to win, shall we? Oh, okay. Oh, wow. I love Step aside! I've sworn to slay all of Dio's demonic minions. Run, little girl. I don't know who you are, but you better leave her alone, you poor wretch. Shackled by the chains of this harpy's insidious mind control, on my honor, as a gentleman, I will free you! Oh, uh, I'm sorry, sir. Did you bump your head? <laughs> Total concentration! What a freak! Most unorthodox! I like the voice acting they got here. Uh, yeah, careful, dude. This puppy bites. Pretty hard. I love the animation here. It's amazing. <laughs> oh. Again, that looks amazing! <laughs> Nicely done, guys! Nice try! Incredible! You could teach me a thing or two! I mean, honestly, these two could work together and beat you. <laughs> oh, man. This is pretty cool. Oh, this is not good. I got you. Uh, do you, dude? I don't think you do. Did he get it? Two inches off. Oh. Nice. Damn. That's not good. Wow. <laughs> Oh wow, it's over. Really? Hey, that was surprising. Crying really hard on me, shit, hold me for all. Please don't touch me. <laughs> on paper, Tanjo did initially seem to have more advantages in this bout. Uh, for sure. He'd been training for way longer than Jonathan, yeah. and with way more experienced teachers. Tanjiro's Demon Slayer journey took place over a couple of years, while Jonathan's Ripple training was less than a month. Tanjiro was obviously a superior swordsman with a variety of powerful techniques and katana magic, while Jonathan really only improvised as a swordsman. But that's where the advantages stop. Sure, Jonathan wasn't a natural swordsman, but he more than made up for it in hand-to-hand -hand combat, while Tanjiro was pretty much out of options without a blade. Jonathan also had an edge in strength. 
Comparing Tanjiro to Doma and Jojo to Tarkus, Jonathan was over twice as strong. And that while is impressive. Fought the more powerful Muzan. Jonathan did the same with Dio. He was way faster too. While Tanjiro and his pals could dodge lightning, we can compare Jonathan to other Ripple users like Joseph, who could dodge light, which is over 3,000 times faster. That might seem crazy, but in part three, Dio was able to keep up with stance like Star Platinum, which can move faster than light. Dio did yeah. this on his own, and that was this is insane, JoJo's Jonathan's adventure. Body. Even with multiple ways to predict Jonathan's movements and see the flow of his Ripple with X-ray vision, Tanjiro would not have been fast enough to keep up. Especially with the Ripple backing him up. Sure, the water and fire Tanjiro generates is impressive, but Jonathan was dumb enough to power through it. Tanjiro, though, had no way to defend against the Ripple bypassing his durability and directly messing with his organs. Such as manipulating his muscles like a puppeteer, or directly shutting off his brain or heart. Something other Ripple users have wow. done to ordinary humans with a single zap. And Jonathan had the opportunity to do this literally every time Tanjiro blocked his blade. Sure, Tanjiro could recover himself with a breath, but that'd be a breath spent healing and not, you know, fighting. And while sun breathing's overuse was dangerous to Tanjiro, Jojo's Haman had no such drawback. Mm. Which meant that Jojo could keep fighting for his yeah, long as he needed. Yeah, look at that. Tanjiro was never gonna go down easy, but Jonathan's speed, Haman, He gave him a hell of a fight, I will say that. Carried him to victory. Jonathan did Breath away. Boom. The winner is Jonathan Joestar. That was, that was good. Who's next? Oh, Thor again. Vegeta. Alright, so that's the fight. And honestly, I was a little surprised for how this went. Uh, mostly because I thought with what Tanjiro, Tanjiro can do, I thought he would have ended the fight with that, you know, with his blade going right through uh, Jonathan's chest. But... No, nope, uh, it wasn't enough. I still love how they incorporated the animation uh, with Tanjiro when he uses his water and fire attacks from the series onto this fight. I thought they did a fantastic job with that. Good job, guys. That was awesome. Uh, and I was a little sad with the ending, but, you know, still not bad. Thor versus Vegeta, though. That one, uh, it's going to be very tricky because on one hand, we've seen what Thor is capable of and how powerful he is. But we've also seen how strong and, you know, how much of a badass Vegeta is. So, I don't know. I don't really know how that fight's going to go. Either way, I know it's going to piss off the Dragon Ball Z event if Thor ends up getting the victory. But we'll see how it goes. Honestly, I would love it if they had Vegeta holding up Mjolnir. That, <laughs> that would be pretty cool. Either Mjolnir or Stormbreaker. I don't care. Either one. Let's not be honest. Vegeta is more worthy of those weapons than Goku is. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you have a different opinion about this death battle fight or what you think about the uh, next one that's coming up, leave some comments below. Let me know what you think. Hit the subscribe button. Check out my Facebook page. Get my Twitter page. Check out T3 Media's channel. Subscribe to their channel. Keep up to date with videos. Check out uh, Death Battle and Ruthless Cheese's channel. Subscribe to their channels. Keep up to date with the videos. And I'll see you next time to give you more love and more entertainment. Until then, take care. Be safe. Love you all. And goodbye.